time with you here and him managing against these guys for the first time. You know, before I came up, I have a text on my phone waiting, so I'm sure there's some remark <laughs> that uh, we'll start a three days of some bantering back and forth, but uh, it, it's always fun. It's always fun, whether it's the conversation before or after the game or what takes place inside it. Uh, I know one thing, they're, they've got a very good lineup, uh, and they'll be well prepared. What, what's the biggest thing you took from him, just when you were working with him here? Obviously, you guys go back further than that, but just the four years you worked together here. His ability to blend the personalities that have come through this clubhouse door over the eight years he was here. Uh, he had such a knack and a way to connect with so many different people and, and to bring them all to a common point. And players love playing for him. Uh, they ran through the wall for him. And he just had a, he just had a way of making every player know or, or feel uh, that he was behind them, supported them. Uh, and if there were any issues, which there were, that it was handled in an appropriate way. Was it the same? Oh, I'm sorry, can you speak a little louder? Was it the same for you as a coach? Not, I mean, obviously it's different because you're working together, but as far as like running through the wall, is that the same sort of mentality? Well, he, he treated us great. So we, we wanted to do the best job that we were capable of uh, as well. He made you feel uh, part of a team. Uh, he didn't you know, make anyone feel like they didn't have a voice or an opinion or, or have an ability to contribute to what we were trying to get accomplished. So uh, he's just got a very good way with people to make them feel included.